The Judgment Day has turned themselves into one of the most formidable groups in all of WWE. Cutthroat tactics, rule bending, backstage ambushes. They'll do whatever it takes to win. I respect Judgment Day's approach to competition. Why play by the rules and wait your turn when you can just go take what you want? If you don't like it, then stay out of their way. Saying that Judgment Day's business might be easier said than done. They're always looking for their next target to annihilate. Yeah, but they've got to deal with the seedy underbelly in the D'Angelo family. While Stax and Tony might ring. Nice suplex. And this one might be headed ringside. Grabbing a kendo stick. This is turning into Swanson Street. A two out of three falls match can be so difficult. So, what's the key to victory? Sheer stamina. You need to win two matches in one, so you have to save your energy for a second and potentially a third fall. Otherwise, you'll fade down the stretch. He's got a plan for that table, and it does not involve a dinner party. Goes under the rock. Oh, look at him up. Uh-oh. This is not going to be pretty. Leg breaker. And Priest's size and agility is negated as he faltered there. Returning to the ring. Ow. Now he's been forced to take a breather. Now six thumbs from that table. Oh, no. Uh -oh. And a first DDT. Sure, what they're thinking. That was a hell of a maneuver there, guys. And that horrific force might have like that. He scores a fall. Oh, man. He steps foot in the ring again. Effective arm drag. Oh, God, that hurt. The challenger eating up some damage. Yeah, Finn tipped those scales in his favor with that attack. Oh, and Stax fights back. Take down. Kip connects with a body. They throw a bang! Gotta see a new champ! He's burying elbows in the midsection. Big right hand connects. Incoming. Drive by. You have to respect these men for taking it to the next level. This one's becoming too close to call. Yeah, it's hard to predict how this one will end. And there's the takedown. Finn gets stopped in his tracks. Sent to the outside. Looking for his next form of attack. Knife edge chop. Uh-oh. Face full of turnbuckle. The challenger is not in a great place. They were about to see a body go through a table. And it's a gut. Enough. Oh, right on point. This'll do it. Broken arrow. And he's taking this to the outside now. Now this is a textbook example of how to bend the rules. Using the forearm to their advantage. Balor has him marked. Harp elbows to the... Jeopardy! Big knee to the mid. Fully placed, stomp to the arm. Nice side headlock applied. Oh, oh, right hand for good measure. And here comes. 
comes Old Faithful. The steel chair is in hand. And this match will head back to the ring. Draped across the top rope. Flying forward. Moves outside. What's the plan here? Oh, this is not going to be good. Hoisted him up. And the champion scores a ball. He's got a plan. Uses an elbow to disrupt that attack. Muscling up there. I can't begin to imagine what he's got planned here, guys. Maybe it's a yard sale. Beautiful Northern Lights suplex. Look at this crowd. It's insanity in here. Bedlam. Setting foot in the ring now. Knockout victory. This one is over. even happier to avoid going through a table. A tables match takes its toll, but they were able to pull out the win here. Back at the drawing board for Tony and Stax. When the job doesn't go your way, it's on to the next one. And there's an argument to be made that defending the title is even harder than winning it, wouldn't you say? Absolutely. You've got your name in the history books. Now it's about what kind of legacy you're going to leave. And that going for an early pin. He goes for the quick pin attempt. Looking for the quick pin. He's got him covered. A quick cover. And that only gets a one count. Looking to secure an early victory. Outside of the ring now. What's the plan here? A table. The WWE Universe is going wide. Look at this. Oh, the high risk doesn't pay off. Really thought that was going to work, but now we got a human being we have to scrape off the floor. Well, that'll do some serious damage. Producing a trampoline. No clue what he hopes to find down there. And he gets tossed back into the mat. Oh, what a super kick, a double super kick. Jimmy Uso is pushing himself beyond his limits. This is going to pay dividends. Top rope. Uso splash. The title might change hands. There's two. He gets the fall. The hammer right on the lower back. A continuous rush on Sami Zayn here. Sami has to wake up and ignore any distractions. Stiff elbow will break that up. Momentum going back to Zayn's corner. But Zayn has to push now while the window's open. That's not right. Deconstructing the knee there. Well, timely counter by Zayn. Oh. 
He catches Jimmy with a counter. Maybe he's found a new source of aggression to battle back with. Jimmy Uso looking dangerous in there. Jimmy Uso is getting that unstoppable look in his eyes. The effects of this match are shocking on the champ. Showing a lot of fortitude in this extreme rules match for sure. But not sure how much more terrible it can be. I don't know what they're looking for here. And he's going with the great equalizer here, the steel chair. He's back into the ring. Wedging the chair into the turnbuckles. Oh, there's some gouging going on. That's unnecessary. Champion Jimmy Uso was just hungrier tonight. Here is your winner, and new heavyweight champion Jimmy Uso. He won the title here in the gold. The now former champion, obviously not happy with this outcome. I did not think a title change was in the cards here tonight. Here we go, with the title on the line, the stakes in this match really couldn't be any higher. Uh, you can tell these superstars are ready to give their all to walk out of here the champion. They might be limping out of here if this match is even half as intense as I think it might be. Ooh. Oh my God, a DDT! the three count there. Oh, directly to the neck. Challenger's a little worse for wear now. Balls count anywhere matches are uniquely demanding. He should know that. Slam! What an impact. Just a ferocious assault from McIntyre. I think Enzo has nothing to do with Drew right now. I, I can't blame him. With a match like this, you really need to open yourself up to the fact that every location is essentially a blank canvas. You aren't bound to the confines of the ring. There's just something to acknowledging that level of freedom that can allow a superstar to do things they usually wouldn't do and get great results from doing it. Oh, Drew has in store next. 
Styles doing what he can do to alter the beatdown. Yeah, his instincts are taking over. Yokes up their opponent. Driven down with a sidewalk slam. This is going to get ugly. Air raid crash. Is it up? The cover! Two! Stopping the refs count at two. This is no time to hesitate. You can feel the end coming. Reciprocating the initial reversal. The countdown is on, gentlemen. McIntyre, sight set. Hits the claim I think the champ's got it. Keeping the championship dream alive. It was almost just lights out on their championship dreams. Let's see if that kick out was a spark or is it the challenger's last gasp? And now McIntyre is at a loss as his mind races to rethink his attack. Able to capitalize on McIntyre's mistake. Oh, that's that's a line. It's cinched in. This could be over. Drew McIntyre looking to free the arm and does just that. Answering back. with an incredibly ruthless sequence. But AJ can't let this flourish derail him. AJ with the wherewithal to avoid that. Right to the lower back. This match and the well-being of Drew McIntyre and AJ Styles hang in the balance. At this juncture, it's about who can still fight. from the Scottish Warrior. The Scottish Warrior delivering that like a bolt out of the blue. Kick to the gut. Face rush. Styles has no control here. Drew exhibiting all his power and force. He's getting up, but there's danger in front of him. The title is going nowhere. Kiss your name. Tonight. Here is your winner, and still total wrestling world champion, the Scottish Warrior, Drew McIntyre. What a win for the champ as he retains the title. What a title defense for him tonight. He came in with that unshakable champion mentality.